Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. How are you? Thank you so much for watching my video daily and make sure you subscribe my YouTube channel over here and turn on the notification bell. I do video every single day. This video is we're going to do an unboxing from youth to the people. Oh my god, they sent me this PO box. Let's open this baby up, see what's in here. Hi, I'm Steve Jan, founder of Ibu Beauty, and these are my sister. We've been together through thick and thin. Nothing comes between us in our family. Just like our bond, the two new releases of the Mooncast collection, our Hero Serum and Hero Moisturizer, are the super duo. Nothing will come between your skin and the Ibu superpowers. So let's uh, open this baby out right now. Oh my god, I'm so thankful that they sent this to me. On the box, it's completely yellow with the black prints here. It says, you to the people, and superfood, science, 100% vegan, no animal testing, made in California skin for all. I love it. Let's open this up. Whoa, look at this. Oh my god, this is so cool. This is so cool. Oh my goodness, guys, look at this. Wow. This thing is uh, very expensive to me. I love it. So find yourself. I found myself in a dream. So they give you a notebook, I guess. Oh, this is 100% recycled paper. And then there's a new product, I think. Oh, she's a pretty big bottle. Wow, this box is for two items. This is really, really cool. It looks to me it's their new cleansing balm. Yes, duh, Steve's right here. Super berry drink cleansing balm. It says right over here. I didn't even look. It says right here. This flash melting velvety whip cleansing balm. Ooh, I can wait. You know what? I have a makeup right now. This is perfect to remove the makeup and see how this works. Let's put this box away so we can look at it. First, let's look at this book right here. You know, I really like this notebook because even the cover is made with recycled paper. I don't know, can you see it, the texture? And in here, you can see there's a yellow cover right here. My dream, you want to write down your dream, and then dream analyst and emotion of a dream. I don't know what that means, but I definitely do believe that, you know, we all need to dream big in our life. Don't let people tell you what you can do and what you can do. Follow your dream, but also be smart, right? And um, I do believe that, you know, you send this very positive energy out there, say, I want to do something, something, something. The universe is going to receive that, and then you're going to accept that from the universe. And working hard, dream big, together, you're going to have a better chance to be successful. A little bit too low right here. <laughs> okay, so I see this. So this is the, like I say, uh, Superberry Dream Cleansing Balm, 3.3 ounce. Let's open this up. I really like their product though, because I've been using the product for a while now. I usually get it from Sephora. Oh, um, by the way, um, I'm pretty sure Sephora going to carry this. Sephora VIP sales coming up, I think the first of November. Uh, so definitely check it out. Whoa, this is pretty. It's a very solid, heavy duty glass cleansing balm. It's all in the yellow colors. So let's put this to a try to see how this works. Just turn on Sephora's app so I can see right now. It is available on Sephora right now. And this baby is selling, hold please, it's selling for $34. So you can either get 20% off, 15 or 10 based on your Sephora status. Definitely check it out. And let's see what's in here. So there's a lot of good ingredient. It's cleansing balm, so really designed for all skin type because you don't leave it on, right? And cleansing balm is really designed to remove makeup, not to just cleanse the face. And I definitely recommend after using cleansing balm, you still want to use a cleanser to wash your face. This baby right here contains sunflower, jojoba sea oil to nourishing the skin to melt away the makeup and the dirt and make your skin feel soft. It also contains superberry antioxidant, which is goji berry and asahi berry, and it's uh, it provides you oxidation from the stress. Then you finish with the. It also contains hyaluronic acid to offer continual hydration. That's really good. When you open this, it is a solid. That's good. So I'm gonna just go ahead to 
open this. Uh, use my finger. Oh my god. See that? It's like whoops. So I want to put this on my face. This is perfect. Oh, this is kind of dry falling. Okay. It has a very. It doesn't have a. It has a smell, but I don't think it's a fragrance. It's a natural berry that I'm smelling. I cannot tell. As you massage to the skin, it starts melting all the makeup. I can feel that on my face. Just need a little bit. You just have to be careful. See that dropping? Because it's, I think it's because it's brand new. So right now it's kind of very solid. So it's hard to, uh, it kind of fall a little bit. So you got to be careful. So just massage like this. It's very nice. Soft feel. Let's see, can I get around the eye area? Mm. Feels so good. You know, I see a lot of blogger, YouTuber when they're using cleansing balm or like a milky makeup remover. They wipe the lipstick all over the face. I would definitely recommend you don't that because lipstick has a lot of pigment and chemical in there. You really want to use your eye makeup remover to remove the lipstick, uh, not using cleansing but then wipe all over the face. I know that looks really cool for social media but that's really not good for the skin so I'm going to tell you that. Okay, as I massage it in there, it doesn't get any more oilier. It's kind of thick, um, kind of thick uh, texture to it. You know, some of the cleansing might become very oily, very greasy, but this is actually feel pretty good. So I about wipe this off now? So this is the white towel, right? So I have, I have a, it's a wet towel already. I don't have a lot of makeup, so it should all come out like really good. Oof. You should be able to rinse it off of water, but since I'm in the studio, it's hard to get water in here. So I just use a wet towel. It made the skin feel very velvety, very soft, very, very smooth. That has to be the um, hyaluronic acid in there. Let me know what type of makeup remover do you like to use. Are you using the makeup wipe, or are you using the spray and the wipe, or are you using milky cleanser or cleansing balm? And it's always interesting to share information here because like I say, our YouTube channel, it's not just only mine, it's ours. And like imagine you guys are watching this, you share information, we can all learn with each other. So I appreciate that when you make the comments that, you know, we can learn something from you too. So, wow, it feels really good. Definitely will be using this a lot. And wow, this is a glass jar. This is fancy. Very expensive. Alright, thank you so much. You to the people send this to me. I really appreciate this. Cleansing balm. I use so much cleanser and cleansing balm. This is so good. It feels nice. Oh, by the way, little tip right here. How do you know your cleansing balm or cleanser is good for you? Is after you rinse off the water, if your skin feels very tight, very, very dry, that means that's too aggressive for your skin. Ideally, when you use either cleansing balm or cleanser, your skin, after rinse of water, your skin should feel comfortable, but not too dry. Because if it's too dry, it actually strips away all your natural oil on the skin, and that will make your skin more oily in the future. So, so thank you so much. Yay! And thank you so much for watching my video today, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye!